Hi. Uh, this thing's called Large Grid 995. Yeah, Kappa, kinda don't care right now. There's a dude with a skull helmet pointing a gun at me. Yeah, hello there. Ah. So, you guys are the guys that stole our ship. Now you're gonna have to pay. I can't, I can't pay, the ATM doesn't work. Well, you can just pay with your lives then. Uh, uh oh, jeez. Ah, uh, the safe zone's uh, not stopping them from shooting. My TFB. life is not uh, worth that much. <laughs> but, uh, I'm leaving. Why can we not? Uh, I can't open no. the door! Rough. Okay, go, 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 Jump, 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 otherwise they can follow us. Jump! I am trying to. Okay. Better. He shot your jump. spotlight. How are we going to get back to the carrier? We're over 500 kilometers away. We'll oh. have to wait for it to recharge, I guess. Probably should have specified to Capac not to do a full length jump. It wasn't a full length jump. It was 25%. Oh, okay. That's all right. At least you, you thought that through. Excellent. Good, good. How were they able to shoot in the safe zone? I want that technology. Yeah, I didn't see that as a suit upgrade option. In, like, I'm not quite sure how they could. That but... seems like a thing that if you had it, you probably wouldn't want to sell it in your shop that was protected by a safe zone. You make a valid point. It also does seem like a thing that a space pirate is probably gonna try and research. I'm just glad they didn't have aiming training. All right, well, speaking of aiming training, are we ready to head back to the carrier? Yeah, uh, are we ready? Is your jump drive charged? Yep. All right, let's head back. All aboard. I am currently aboard my wasabi. And you are locked onto me. Would you mind releasing me, Kapak? Uh, are we there? Oh yeah, that's him over there. Them, you mean us? Well, there's multiple ships that I can see, so I say them. What? Kapak, you mind releasing me? Well, um... Let's not head back there. Not in a hurry, anyway. No, not until we've got more guns on the carrier, I'd say. Yeah, I can I can still see the trade station, but I don't think we're going to be moving the carrier near it. I think if we're going to go there, we need to kind of sneak in there and just sell something, get out. So send you on your own? Uh, Potentially, yeah, I suppose. You are the one with the money. Yeah, I was about to say, why me? And then you said that, and I was like, oh, yeah. I did manage to sell one thing, but I didn't manage to sell the, uh, the pod. But I saw the big thing. Hey, when they said green and white, did they mean this uh, thing? Yeah, oh. it was the other. Yeah, it was the. Big oh, bit of that. I thought it was the other big one, the wreck one. Maybe they did mean this one. No, that was a bit from the wreck. Remember that it sheared off before we even got. No, there. no, not the chunk. The the thing Capac's been using as a warship. Oh. I guess we probably don't want to be selling off too much of the green and white stuff since that's theirs and they might be unhappy. Are you, about. Are you suggesting we respray it first? Do you reckon that'd be enough? I'd assume so. Alright, I'm on it. Uh, we need to find any if any serial numbers that are on there, we need to file them off as well. I'm sure upstaying traders wouldn't notice such a thing. <laughs> well, I mean, they're buying scrap from us, so. Yes, without asking many questions. <laughs> yeah. Right, I'm reconnected to the carrier. As am I, and fully repaired. Alright, I need to set up some auto crafting, so I'm going to set up a bit of a server room up near the front. I started building one, but I don't really like it, so I'm going to make a new one. Uh, Alright, I am going to um, pay and spray this stolen ship. <laughs> Sounds delightful. Okay, that works. No one will ever know. I thought I just act I'm always terrified of using build plan. I'm gonna miss and accidentally paint the block I'm aiming at. Actually, no, worse would be accidentally repainting the whole carrier. That would upset me greatly, yes. Luckily, <laughs> there is something I called I would not reloading. be impressed. I can repaint it for you if you want. Well, I I did repaint the corridors a bit, Kevac. Did you it notice? One's purple anyway. Yeah. I made it, I roughed it up a bit because it was a bit too garish. Oh. Wasn't I mostly grey before? 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you think you would have kept it that color. But notice the oh, yellow has right. changed. Sorry, I forgot it's split sync. Yeah, gray counts as garish for him. No, oh, it's the yellow <laughs> bits. I thought I'd make the yellow of the refineries brighter and the yellow over here darker so that you kind of look down and see that kind of the lightness of the yellow coming through more. It makes it stand out a bit. So I dulled the rest of the yellow around it. Jeez. My grey is there entirely to make bright colours brighter. That's what I do. Uh, like uh, laundry powder? <laughs> yes, actually. That's my job. That's the grey man's job. Oh yeah, why have we had this wasabi that's like attached to the carrier by like its side? Because that's how I attach the wasabi to the carrier at the moment. Because I... So, something that I've been doing as we've been building this is I've been trying to complete things as I go rather than letting myself get fully sidetracked by another job. That's um, the worst way to do it. Arguably, yeah. Maybe. I'm not sure. But I've been doing it this way because I wanted to try and give like try and give myself the best chance to make sure every part as we finished it looked good and looked finished so one of the things i was just working on now was i was going to try and set up the auto crafting but i wanted to set up this corridor because i was going to build the auto crafting thing in it and i had to move where the corridor was as capac had set it up because it was messing up the outer armor because it was set up by me that means he had to change it no, I like what you did. I just didn't like where it was. Because it didn't work. Because you didn't... You didn't know what was there before. Because it wasn't finished. Um, did we end up deciding if the vehicle elevator was going to go in this section or if it was going to go in the next section? Um, oh, right. Yeah. Uh, we need to decide where the jump drives are going to go. And I think if we decide that... So, actually, come back. I think we can put it in here, as long as it only comes up to the height of these these doors here, like this so, this height. Yeah, so it needs to be level with the corridor, yeah. and it needs to drop down to this level, and it and, needs to drop down below. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't need to go any higher than that. I think we can do that, and I think we can do that while fitting the jump drives in here. Meteor storm inbound. Uh -oh. Oh. Meteor storm inbound. Um, TFE? You're on um, shield I'm duties. Sure, I'm pretty sure my guns are on. I mean, they shot down the last meteors that turned you're up. You're also in the way of the sun re relative to the carrier, so you're right where you should be. Oh, yeah, that's so my solar panels can charge you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hear gun shooting. Yeah, I see the meteors. Oh, you got one. Hey. You got two. Three. Four. Wow. <gasps> oh. I think the interior turrets are doing a better job against the meteors than the Gatling. Maybe. Hmm. Oh no, we're in space, that wouldn't work. It's a shame. I think we're going to turn my lights back on. Uh, yeah. Anyway, back to corridor. Oh, which way's up? Alright, so <laughs> if we assume a platform that's 5 by 5 then we need to take out that row. So, Kabak, were you imagining some wheeled vehicles to be parked somewhere? Uh, at some point, yes, but I have no idea where, or when, or how, or who, or why. <laughs> Part of me that wonders whether we could put the jump drives down the bottom here. Yay, I'm gaining yeah. power! Don't, don't we want them relatively central so they're quite well protected, though? Yeah, we do. I was just thinking that the refineries provide them a degree of protection because of how resilient they are if they're near a refinery and the refinery gets hit the refinery will stop anything from going through and hitting them but as long as we don't stick them right next to the hydrogen tanks it should be okay and my plan would be to put some welders and stuff near the hydrogen tanks just to give them a bit of extra resilience all right so ignoring all that let's keep making this corridor idea that i was working on i gotta start thinking about um airlocks now yeah okay because it doesn't it doesn't need to be any bigger. Because any vehicle is going to be need to be small enough to fit through these doors anyway. It doesn't need to be wider than three blocks. You talking? You still talking about the elevator? Yeah. It does need to be bigger than the doors. Because we can offload from the lift, 
straight into the next section forward. And we could have air we could have airtight hangar doors there instead of the big garage doors. But but if it's I'll need to make it bigger then, because if it's only a five by five footprint, uh there won't be room on the platform. Well this is this is why I think the platform should be a full cage so that we can attach the pistons to the top of it rather than the pistons taking up any of the space on the platform. Uh, but it they, the pistons still need to be connected to the platform somehow. No, no, they connect to the cage at the top. It, the, the cage has to be connected to the platform. Yeah, and you use plate. Oh, plate. Plate is for lamos. You're a lamo. Oh dear. Oh well. Whoa! Why am I hearing clang noises? Uh, who uh, dropped what on the ground? It was just me dropping some components because I was full. Right, oh, get them. I love having access to fans that occupy a full block so I can make a small airlock. Smooth with the ceiling, yeah. Uh, they are quite nice, the new fan blocks. But, uh, both versions. Oh, that was real weird. What's that? Why did you have to do that? Whoever's painting. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> it's me. So you started painting at the same time that I started typing to search for pistons <laughs> in the item list. So I'm like, dunk, dunk, dunk. Wait, why? Why is it making painting noises when I type? <laughs> hey, there's another um, of those heavy shuttles you mentioned. Oh, it's Mark Two. Oh, yeah, the WYCC ones. What it's faction is that? Well, well, we've... hopefully the space pirates won't care. Wayland Yutani civilian. Uh. It's probably infected. We should probably not uh, not bother with it. Okay. Yeah, we've uh, we've learned our lesson. Uh, we're never going to pirate again. Nah. No. Simple. No, no that doesn't we, seem likely. No, we're just going to make it deniable. <laughs> yeah. We're never going to pirate again. <laughs> says the mercenary. <laughs> huh? Chapter being was sneakier about. You're a mercenary. That doesn't mean I'm a pirate. It does if you paid for it. You, how much? No, do you that pay makes again? me a privateer. You guys are a boys. government agency, right? <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, we got a flag, sure. How did I end up here in the first place? I've forgotten. I'm not sure either. Uh, Splitsy probably tricked you. That's usually how these things work. Oh, one of those, I didn't read the fine print. Yep. Helps when there's no print at all. Although, the shuttle sounds pretty small. What, what could it be infected with? Do you want to go have a look? I, I'm Maybe. I'm game if you are. Um, let's check to see if anyone's watching before we um, attack it. If we do fly near it, oh, I can't see it anymore. Else. Anyway. Oh, is it gone? No. Oh. Well. Oh. Easy come, easy go. I guess. Are they spying on us? That's very convenient timing. <laughs> it does seem it, or inconvenient timing. It's going to be inconvenient for, for us. Oh, next one we see, I guess we can have a look. Yep. Oh, no. What have you done? Uh, it's more what have you done? What's he done? So, Kabak, by putting the catwalks as the middle of these corridors, they're no longer airtight. Uh, so they'll have to share air tightness with the area below. That wasn't my idea. That was your idea. You're the one that said we could just put the efficiency modules under the catwalks. I should have just thought it was I mean, thing. I mean, we could just change it for... Well, if we put armor plates, would that be airtight? It would be. It'd be less interesting, though. Is it a really big problem? Like, it'll only be these ones on the side. Because the next the next section forward won't be won't lack air tightness with its itself. Uh, uh, it would kind of be really weird having the whole like system be pressurized except for this one segment right. Before no, no, the no. Airlock. It'll be pressurized. It'll just be sharing air tightness with this area below. Oh, uh, I guess that's fine. But we'll have to make sure that it's pretty well sealed down here. Well, that's why this is an airlock coming into the corridor. And I'll put another airlock at the other... Like, I'll put airlocks... 
because there's no real airlock between the bulkheads. They're just single bulkheads. But I'll put airlocks in the corridors below. Like proper ones. Yeah, they're... They're like emergency bulkheads. Yeah, yeah. Which makes sense. We're going to need a big button up the front that we can punch that will close them all at once. Yep. Well, uh, actually, what I was thinking of doing was I was going to use one of the new AI defense controllers. Whenever it detects an enemy in range, I was going to get it to um, shut down all the doors and turn on emergency lighting. Once we oh, yeah. have so, emergency so lighting. Lock us in. So, so we're trapped and can't get to the bridge whenever there's an attack. No, 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 no. <laughs> Not not lock down the doors, just close them all. Make sure they're all closed. Although we can probably um, just have them all closed automatically most of the time anyway. I've got an idea for um, so we can avoid angering those space pirates. Oh? Um, those grinder arms I put in the, my front of my ship that we weren't going to need because we were sending to a station, I could just grind them down into bits. And then they'd never be able to prove that we'd done it because they have no <laughs> evidence. <laughs> Sure, that sounds like it'd work. I mean, it's more subtle than having a green ship right next to a giant purple carrier. Oh, okay. Well, uh, Kapak, weren't you painting that ship? Wasn't he respraying it? Yeah. It is. It's done. Okay. Tiffy just said it was green. Is it? Did you not even look before you said it, that? It, it is, I, it is everything some, but green. My ship there is no green. All right, I blame Tiffy. You TV. need not worry about green. Oh green my. is gone. God, what have you done to it? I camouflaged it. That is... What has he done? No, he's he has Do actually camouflaged it? it. What, he's painted it black? No. With speckles? No, it, no. It is the least possible green it could be. It, and, Kabak, I, I completely uh, commend you. It is actually camouflaged. I am looking at it I from guess? the per correct perspective to be camouflaged. Ah. Oh, what, so it blends into the carrier. Very, very no, you've blended so it into so it the nebula. Into the nebula. <laughs> you've blended into the nebula. If you didn't realize you'd done that, side. did you? No. <laughs> you actually picked the colors of the nebula behind it. <laughs> uh, well, at least on one side. Well, I mean, a good chunk of the colors were the ones were the ones from the nebula. I'm honestly surprised you're building that crane, the thing yourself, Kamak, rather than making me do it. What are you talking about? You normally, you normally have no interest in doing. Oh, please don't do what you're doing. <laughs> uh, because you don't know whether that's ninety degrees offset from the other one. What? Uh, this is not how you connect pistons up. It's there is a an actual orientation to these top piston parts, and it needs to match this piston. Otherwise, you're going to blow it up like you blow up your crane. That sounds like a lot of bad things happening. Yeah. So the way you want to do it, come back. Is no, add, that'd be fine. Add the piston head. Then we get a merge block. We slap it on the side of the piston part. That's boring. Then you can merge that merge block to one further down. Because, yeah. <laughs> that's... That's not... The, why did you put the merge block sideways? Because I thought you were going to do it the other way. Now it's merged. Which means you can no longer use build vision to control those pistons. Is there a way to just switch one of them off? So that nope. the, the other one will just do it? Nope. Wait, what? Because I just put them all on a button ah. and hit uh, reverse. 38 health and then just imploded. Wait. Why is my ship flying, flying away? away? Why is my ship flying away? I don't know. Wait, it's doing that weird thing it was doing before, where it just got randomly flung away, but it killed me. <laughs> wait, what? Are, wait, are you launching it by venting it? No, that's the thing. I, my interior space isn't even pressurized. It just. Huh. That's real weird. Uh, current position. I feel like zero, your ship's zero, haunted. Ten, no, no. Ten, ten, ten. I don't want a randomly haunted ship. I don't like the sound of that. What about an intentionally haunted ship rather than a randomly one? Would that be better? Jeez, my body's 400... My body got sent flying out of the ship despite me being in the middle of it. It was that powerful. Huh. Okay, that's pretty far down. Does it go? So it goes down to the height of the, the wings? So the top of the cage is below the bottom of the wings, yeah. So there okay. should be plenty of room. 
the bottom of the lift uh, ideally should be made out of plate or catwalk so that we can drive off it if we're in gravity. Now I'm terrified that my ship is going to randomly slam me into a wall and go flying. Yeah, I can understand why you'd be concerned about that. Ever since I built that gravity gen, why does it start doing that? That is really weird. Yeah, when I was first messing around with the settings, it randomly... It didn't kill me, though. That was a weird thing. Last time, it didn't kill me. I just stayed in spot, and the ship just went flying. Hmm. I have, I have no idea how to explain what you're experiencing. It is not making any sense to me, either. It's acting uh, like it's sometimes got artificial mass. Yeah. Which is confusing and strange, and I want nothing to do with it. No, uh, this isn't going to work. What's not going to work? Because this is the level. The big yeah, ones are boarding it. We'll need to nest the pistons up so that they can um, be higher but still have the same reach. Yeah, that'll make it look all weird though. Maybe. And I'll have to but... redesign everything. So, Kabak, instead of trying to design this lift, did you want to design the jump drive? Because what we could do, if you wanted to, instead of putting the lift here, we could move it into the next section forward, which will give us more room to play with. And then you could have a spinny with cool lighting jump drive array in here. Oh, that's what I think of that. Because hmm? if we have the lift here, we have to... We'd obviously have to have the jump drives just locked down. But if you wanted to do a spinny jump module, we could do that. But we'd have to move the lift forward. They're all just... rectangles, though. They don't even spin properly. Um, uh, how, how many of those things are we going to need? I mean, I, personally, I'd like several. That, that's not a number. It's a three, isn't it? It's more, more than a few, it's less than many. How many jump drives do I want? Six? At least four. Probably don't need more than six. Hey, no leaks. Nice. Because, like, TFE's, TFE's ship has two, and our maximum jump before we'd even built this ship was 400Ks. Uh, are, are there effectiveness affected by mass, or is yes. it just quantity mass okay with each one having a certain amount of mass it can move up to 2000 kilometers um so if you have more you can have more so if you can fit eight in there that's great uh oh you just drop by plates and tubes there's gravity they just yeah, went but straight I out didn't, of the ship i didn't finish grinding it down so i don't know why anything would have dropped well it did you're having a day, aren't you? I just unbuilt everything that I'd built over the past... Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I know. You're not the only one who does that. How many times do you reckon I unbuild things by when I realise there's a better way of doing it? It's how things go. It's just how it is. Yeah, but you edit those out to make yourself look clever and you leave mine in to make me look foolish. Don't think I don't know about your plots. Since when? Since always. You realise I've literally posted a video where I chopped a truck in half multiple times, failed to merge block it back together properly, and had to do it like three or four times. Whoa! Um. Why is there a lot of whoa? I think it's because I'm trying to get a grip on how big six of these things are. Yeah. Obviously, we can move all those gyros and we can rearrange the back end to fit around this because this will be kind of the centerpiece if you do it this way. You could probably go down to eight. That would be an interesting addition for the event controller. Um, the ability to detect if a space is no longer pressurized. Air vents do that. Yeah, but I was thinking... Wait, but can you combine it with, like, uh, depressurized yep. to basically suck all the air back in before it's lost? Yep, because you can activate a timer block when it happens. Yeah. Uh, Kappa, can I move one of these so I can get to the cargo? No. That's really annoying. Really? I just need to... I just didn't move one of them. I just needed to remove one... Remove one of them. So I can get... So I can keep building this corridor. So apparently I've been attacked by, um, Clang's cousin that is powered only by gravity gens. <laughs> Energy <laughs> critical. Ah! Yeah! 
You're dying. No, I got hit in the head by a spinning jump drive. What? Why jump drive spinning? <laughs> I'm trying to think of how to mount them in the... I think your ceiling mounting was a great idea because then we can have like lights coming in from all around and you could use neons on them and things like that. And having the two of them, you could counter spin them if you wanted. Although it'd probably look better if they both spun the same way. I didn't realize you were trying other ones because I thought you were. You looked at that and be like, "Yeah, this works." All right, Kabak. Since I critiqued what you did, do you want to come and critique my corridor? Where my steel plates go. Clean out the hole. No, they landed on a girder. So we got an airlock. Sure. Yep. Then we come into the corridor. Corridor of darkness. Yeah, I probably should put some lights in here at some point. This is meant to be mechanical because obviously it's got the refineries and I'll do something similar on the other side. But we've got some timer blocks and I'm going to put an LCD up here so we've got the auto crafting set up shortly. Uh, there it is. I wonder, uh, is there cargo access down here somewhere? No. You have to go out to the connector. But yeah, I feel like this feels like a service Inventory corridor. Uh, it's annoying oh, we do okay. need to leave this armor on the left here. That can't be changed. Uh, I do have an idea. Oh. We could put stairs and have like a catwalk. Well, we could do the half alongside step. the machinery. We could do the half stair and half, ca but half it, catwalks. It doesn't need a half stair though, because there's plenty of room around know, it on it, both sides. I felt like it would look nicer with a half. Really? Yeah. I feel like it'll look empty with a half. And on which side? Well, I would have. I was thinking. Let me let me do the thing. Because <laughs> if you put it on this side, then it like won't be running alongside the machines. It'll just mm -hmm. be going against the other wall. But if you put it on this side, then it'll just be like a weird skinny catwalk running through the middle of the room. Well, I was thinking maybe... Well, you could even do it here. Straight out of the door, are you mad? Yes. There's a safety Sanity hazard. Insanity is the path to brutes. Why would you do it like that when there's so much room here that you could just put it in the room a bit? Oh, because I was just trying it. Wait, what is going on here? Oh, you added another rock box there. What have I done to upset you now? It's just asymmetrical, so it's throwing off my... Oh, the the other side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll, I'll be getting the other side to match eventually. It's just... It takes a long time to do this stuff, okay? Jeez. No, not okay. Illegal. You're illegal. In some states, yes. How many U.S. states is CapAc illegal in? Oh, I was thinking like a, a state of inebriation. I'm especially illegal. I'm half tempted to add some um, AI enabled bot factories on my ship to help me. <laughs> hey, we've got the money for them now, haven't we? I mean, yeah, they'd be helpful welding up the carrier as well. Well, I'm just. We don't. I'm not sure we've got the resources to just let someone go wild with welding up whatever they want. Because I, how like how much can you control what they weld? I guess if they're on my ship, they're fairly safe because they. Won't yeah, because you don't have giant ions to be welded up. So that's my worry about having them on the carrier is yeah. that they'll weld up some of the ions, and we actually don't want them to yet. Yeah, it's mainly I've opened up some more space as like a almost like a top floor, and I needed something to put in there. I'm like, oh yeah, I can stick it where if I to. <laughs> By the time this is over, your ch your ship's going to be bigger than the carrier. Uh, not really, because I'm intentionally. I don't want to change the exterior any more than I already have. All right. What what does heavy armor look like in this texture? Uh, Probably horrific. I think the same. Uh no, no. It's got like little scratches and stuff. What the scratches? scratches and dents and things. Even on the. On the world what's, what's the point of it being heavy armor if it comes pre-damaged? <laughs> oh yeah, it's just got like a sort of concretey kind of texture. Or like a wear and tear, just a few dents and scratches and things. Alright. Izzy's inventory manager is running. I 
have not set up auto crafting yet. I'm just waiting for it to do all its things, and then I'll start setting up the cargo containers. Oh, there's another H HWYCC, although it's not the shuttle, it's something else. Minimus Explorer. Doesn't sound very large. <laughs> no. What do you think, TFE? Um H Trim? Yep. Wasabi, Kabak, you gonna join or are you gonna chicken? Fine, stay here. Wait, you mean if I didn't call you a chicken you'd have come? Uh I don't know, I'm not he, really. He lives down to your expectations. <laughs> Alright. I'm heading in TFA. Very quickly refueling the H tram. Come back, be ready, we may need your help if things go sideways. What do you mean when? Now you want if. to help. Didn't, did I say when, not if? When, when if? I, I thought dang, I said I if. I lost track already. <laughs> Maybe um, I meant to say when. Um. <laughs> yeah, do you want to go in first, TFA? Yep. I'm only going 30 meters a second, so you should be able to get there first. Oh, uh, it's got hydrogen thrusters and uh, it looks pretty small. I'm seeing some turrets. Oh, wait. Oh, vigilante. Something else has turned up. Oh. Uh oh, it's, taking its, way. Uh, it's coming in really quick. They weren't happy about us. Did you get a broadcast? I didn't hear anything. Might just have better security. Oh! Whoa! That was close. Jeez. Yeah, it was. That was unfriendly. Uh, Kabak, oh, yeah. Kabak, you want to get in your ship? Oh. Which ship? Your combat ship. Ah, why are my turrets not firing back? Oh, boy. Are they off? No, they're definitely on. No, my turrets are out of ammo. Well, I guess I'm decoy then. Wait a second, this thing's... I think it's coming to help is large grid. Oh, Ow. Ouch. Hit the enemy fire. Ow, that's a lot of oh, interior turrets. Ugh. Ah, this vigilante is very fast. No. Okay. Um, I have no forward thrust. Oh no. Come back, are you almost here? Uh, the explorer or the vigilante? Vigilante, you need to help TFA. Okay. I've still got a forward thrust to my looks of it. Um, I'm most likely leading it towards you. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Ugh! Uh, oh, right. Oh, it's no option. Or the, uh, the two can, I guess it is now. <laughs> Ow! What do you mean? Ugh. Yeah, it did a number on you. No, I can't go to the station repair. Yeah. If I go to the station repair, I'm going to sneak in. It's kind of difficult for the flight of the ship. You okay? That was close. <laughs> I'm gonna help from a distance. I've still got my uh, cannons. I'm pretty sure. Wait a second, is it repairing its guns? Oh no. What? I think this thing's repairing its guns. There's a dude there. I don't know. Well, it's not repairing my guns. Yeah, there's a hit. <laughs> um, I lost my front facing camera. Uh, I think, I think, um, all right, I'm going to come and see if I can assist with taking out this vigilante so we can get out of here and just oh, leave this thing Oh, just crashed into it. <laughs> oh, that might help. Pushing it away. 
I'm like, he's still pushing it. But oh, there it is. But you didn't notice you'd run into it? Uh, it was wedged in my superstructure. Yeah. <laughs> so, you keep crashing into it. I don't have a clear shot. Like, no, my soap cans are over. <laughs> the just pushing it around. <laughs> It actually was working pretty well. Make the front of that ship out of heavy armor, that could uh, work. Yes. Is it disarmed? Possibly, it's not shooting. I say I might try and see if I can board it. Right, I'm closing as well. I've left the other thing behind. Yeah. I think yeah, I'll need Capac to come in and take out those turrets. It is all it is all interior turrets that it's got shooting at me, but it seemed like it was repairing them. Because I was picking them off and then I was getting shot at by ones that I could have sworn I'd picked off. Just checking. What's the colour pattern on this ship? Uh, white and red. What I can see. Okay. So it's not green and white. <laughs> I'm on board. Oh, good job. Um, ow. Yes, it's remote. Oh, it's... That is crazy! I'm inside, it's freaking out. Where is its brain? Alright, uh, I'm going home. No, Capac, Capac, don't go home! Don't go home! Because oh. we need to make sure Ka TFE's got that, and then you're going to help. You go after the Minimus Explorer. Uh, Whoa! No, it just ejected me. Oh no. I think oh. I might have seen its remote control. Briefly, as I got flung out. Uh, so you're not on board anymore, TV? Uh, back on board. Oh. And it just flung me off again. No. Yeah. Oh, it's small grid. Yeah. It's large grid by all the rockets it was firing. Oh, that's going to make it finding its remote all that much no. harder. It being flung out. I'm trying to see whether there's anywhere I, I can... It's... Okay, it's turning to face me. When again, we're going to pick up... Whoa! What's shooting? Me. Yeah, I was right next to it. He shot me. What the... I thought I saw a purple light uh, that looked like a remote. What's wrong, Kevin? Minimus Explorer just vanished right in front of me. Oh, it had a jump drive. It might have jumped out. That's why I wanted to capture it, because I was like... Ooh. Okay, it's turning jump. to face me. Whoa! It okay, did so summon TV, another it's, vigilante though. Yeah. I want to see how close I can get for a second. Ah, uh, there's another vigilante can a TFE. What? Where? Uh. Oh, that's kind of way away. Capac, you need to intercept that thing. Yeah, that's not how I would describe this situation. TFE, stop moving. I, Let me see if I can I'm find... I'm just damn to us, so. Yeah. If you stop moving, I might be able to find it and shoot it, but if you keep moving, it keeps moving. Okay, I just completely stop moving. Ow. And it's still moving anyway. Yeah, it's too Alright. Um, ow. Did ow. it just... It just disintegrated. What? When you shot it, it just exploded. Yeah. Uh, you okay, Kabak? Oh. Do you get killed? Wait, so yep. where's the other vigilante? It's... It's shooting up Kabak's ship. Oh. What's left of it? I was wondering what was doing. Huh? Oh. Actually, you know what? Should we just leave it? I mean, if it's distracted by his... I just don't want it to come back to the carrier. Yeah, where's it going to go next? Yeah, alright, I'm going in. I mean, heck, it might go and attack the space pirates first. Oh, that is brutal. Okay, so we know lot we know not to mess with the Wayland Yatani Corporation. Or bring bigger guns. <laughs> I already told you that. Well, you didn't do a very good job of convincing us not to, did you? I, mean, I told you said... they were probably infectious. I don't know what else I could say to be more convincing. Yeah, but there's a difference between infectious and have really nasty weapons. <laughs> oh, don't shoot at me, you jerk. Yeah, come on, keep it, bu keep it busy. <laughs> Need to keep on body. I know. 
Oh, direct hit. Oh no. And it got a direct hit on me. Uh, stop firing. Oh no, there it goes. If we manage to scare off the other one, we might be able to scare this one off. If I can not die. Uh, Kaba, can you control your ship at all? No. Nope. Yeah. Pretty sure the cockpit exploded. So I was just thinking if you could, you could ram this thing. No! Deadly opponent. Um, are either of you two doing anything that might help me here? Um, well not really, because that ship's basically disabled. I've led it back to the carrier. I can bring my jetpack. <laughs> right, well, Could you bring your big ship? Um, pose it. Ah, oh, can't take out this gun. One gun! I'm down to no guns. Oh. Get its turret! Get its turret there. I think I got it. Oh, there's another turret on this side. Yep. Oh, missed it. I wish I had a railgun right now. Alright, I'm on the enemy jump. craft. Okay. Uh, what am I looking for? Just grind everything. Anything that's a conveyor, grind it. Anything that's a tank, grind it. Just grind it all. Good thing you said that. I was about to jump in and probably shoot everything. Well, I figure with a grinder you're not going to blow up a tank in your face. Uh, any luck? I am almost inside. I'm inside. Oh, there's a control seat. Oh, I just destroyed it. There's another control seat. Just keep grinding things. Well, I mean, you could possibly grind and weld up the control seats, but I reckon there's going to be a remote hidden somewhere there. That's why I'm just like, grind all of it. They had tools and stuff in them, but they're all flying away. Uh, there's a reactor. Grind it. And a survival kit. Grind it. Grind it all! Alright, the reactor's non functional. Is it. St it still seems to be moving! Oh! It just ejected me! <laughs> Spinny, spin, spin, spin! Oh, that's dizzying. Tools and supplies. Taking out Emergency a bunch medicals. of its hydrogen tanks. I see some batteries. All right, it's out of fuel. It's just got the ions now. Oh, my jetpack has arrived. <laughs> what the? Medical uh, components flying out the front of it? Uh. Grind, come back, we'll find it somewhere. It's going down before I do. I'm running out of O2. Ow. I'm just killing this thing. I don't care anymore. I don't want its stuff. I just want it dead. I want to make sure it can't call in another friend to attack the carrier. Whoa. 
It just oh. flung me away at high it's speed. Away. Oh. Inventory full. Inventory full. Oh. Inventory full. Inventory full. Oh, I just got flung too. Ah! What? Ah, its guns are working again. Oh, it's lost its gyro, but its guns are still working. No, it has not lost its gyro. It was shooting at me. Well, yeah. I took down two of the guns that were shooting. Seems to have calmed down a little bit. Inventory. So yeah, take out the guns. Oh, assault cannon. That could be. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Let me get my mag boots on. Get me my mag boots on. Inventory full. They got the thrust. Inventory full. Yeah, I took out a bunch of the big thrusters. Whoa! It doesn't seem to Inventory care. Inventory full. Inventory. Oh, there's one. Inventory full. Ah! Jeez, that Gatling gun nearly shot me. Inventory full. Inventory. Full. When's it pointing at me? Oh no, it's aiming cap out. <laughs> Taking out Inventory some of the ion full. thrusters. Inventory cool. Full. Trying not to get body slammed. Inventory yeah. Full. Inventory Got a lot of thrusts though. Inventory full. Inventory full. Oh, just a heads oh. up, my inventory's full. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh. Inventory full. Inventory full. Flinging debris Inventory everywhere. Uh, I'm gonna run out of energy Inventory soon. Full. I'm gonna run out of O2 soon. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm running out of energy. Oh, I see a battery. Do we oh, abandon it? And... Oh, it's shooting. <laughs> um. Whoa! Oh, I found it! I found its thing! I found its thing! What? what? It got like some sort of self-destruct. It but just disintegrated. It, it just disintegrated. Where's my wasabi? Yeah. Where's my wasabi? Where there you it? go. There's a there's a gyroscope left. Who wants the gyroscope? <laughs> <laughs> I want to try and get back with my wasabi because I'm about to run out of oxygen. I've only got 25 oxygen. I have two. Yep. Ow. <laughs> well, uh, good I've luck got, with that. I've got 13 energy. Well, well that oxygen. was productive. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. I just really wanted to give it a go. It seems like we're better off going after the main ship rather than the help it calls in. Uh, oh. Better off being in a situation where we can actually, you know, fight properly. This is true. We just lost half of our military capacity. Help low. Yep, and I'm about to die. Critical. It was a war of attrition. Um, we didn't win. We it. learned something, though. Yeah. Don't attack it. I mean... <laughs> the true power of friendship? I mean, if they ended up... If they were, like, flying near some other ship, we could annoy them in the hope that they'd go and attack the other one. Yeah? I mean, the space pirates won't blame us if they see someone else attacking them. Maybe. Good thing we got all that uranium out of the reactor, though. You did? No. Oh. That would have made it worth it. How do you guys feel about me making a quick run to the trade station to repair the wasabi? I would probably need to take the H-tram as well. <laughs> I will stay here. Okay. Yep. Where's the wasabi at? Oh, jeez, it's gone. It's 8.3 k's away. I put its dampeners on! No! Oh, is it? Yeah, I jumped out with the dampeners on. Apparently it's going at 110 meters a second, too. 100 meters a second. That was, that was kind of catastrophic. I was not expecting that to go so poorly. Like, legit, was not expecting that to go so poorly once Capac joined in with his ship. Yeah, hey, my little robot helper is um, repairing my ship. <laughs> You've got a robot helper? Yeah. Build a thing. Oh, uh, did you need any of the money? Uh, I used the money I already had. Uh, so okay. I'm now flat out broke. I have zero spacecrafts. Ah. Well, don't let your robo friend die. I won't. Uh, do you want to meet me at the orbital trade station? Oh yeah, I'm going to have to... Because you know, we want to get in and out of there quickly. Yep, and my little helper's along the ride. I was tempted to name it Capac 2.0. That would get confusing. I think I didn't make him orange. <laughs> I was more thinking that you're Capac 2.0. Hey. <laughs> I mostly survive. <laughs> we all die once today. 
Well, yeah, other than mysterious gravity uh, distortions. <laughs> <laughs> well, Probably I died a bunch of times. Space-time continuum. Oh, did you die several times, Kai? Can't even remember how many times I've died. Seven kilometers out and closing fast. I am 13.8 kilometers out and closing at max speed. Oh, I thought you were already at the station. No, 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 no. I'm still not sure how this sneaking is going to go when I'm on fire. Um, uh, the sneaking is the speed at which we get in, get repaired, get true. out. Uh, my biggest challenge is I have no reverse thrust, which is why my turning on my dampeners and jumping out didn't work. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm broke, so I'm going to need you to pay for the pay. Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm currently trying to line myself up to hit their station so that I can stop. <laughs> what was your hmm come back? How's the jump drive design coming? I think I'm happy with it. Although where I've placed them at the moment, they may not all be aligned right. No, I missed! No, oh, I missed! Geez. <laughs> Did you see how quickly I came through? It is, yeah. Oh, I thought I... I just... I just missed two. And now, now you're a kilometer away. <laughs> that must look pretty cool from the inside. Me flying through at that speed. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> almost got decapitated. I think. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of hard to target when there's um, the safe zone messing with the appearance of things. You're just going to crash distortion. into me now, aren't you? Because I'm on the landing pad. Oh no, looks like you're a little bit high. <laughs> Perfect. Yes! Hello! <laughs> Me and Hello. my um, little friend have arrived. <laughs> okay. Let's get out of here before we get found. Yeah. Quickly repair my ship, because I'm broke. <laughs> Might need to build projection uh, as well. It like, appears to be missing important bits. Sell grid as scrap. Hey! <laughs> oh. What's gonna do if I'm sick on oh. There you go. Um. Did only fix some of it? Did it? Yeah, it, found, like, it fixed like the front bit. Oh, that's that better? some more of it. Oh, looks like it only does a certain amount each time. I'm still on fire, but it's a lot less fire. It's getting very expensive, TFA. Yeah, why is it? Are you mostly intact now? Minus a turret and a reversing thruster and a lifting thruster. Is there scrap in the way of those or something? I so. Wasabi looking. Definitely in better condition than it was before. Yeah, my wasabi is too. But I don't have my camera, I don't have a bunch of things. It's a trick they get you to go back for multiple repairs by not fixing everything. <laughs> Or they're not happy with us with the whole pirates turning yeah. up and shooting inside the Either station. way, I don't think we got I don't think we can hang around here. Get out of here. Yeah. The dark light freighter. Don't think I'll be going near you. I mean I I I'll be interested in taking on these things when we've got more combat ships, but yeah. Don't we have the capability to make more? No. Not in a reasonable time frame anyway. No, I I'm I'm probably going to be a little bit gun shy for a for a short period, I think. Okay, what's Capac uh, been up to? I guess we'll find out when we get back to the carrier. See what he's done with the jump drive design. Oh, I'm getting slightly close to it. It'll be fine though. Uh, no. Fire flight, fruit flight. No, not fine. Dang it. Um. If it's targeting one of us and we're careful, uh, the turrets on your me. ship should take it out. My turret, one of them's on fire and the other doesn't have ammo. No, not your H tram, your big ship. Oh yeah, so just lure it back to the big ship. Yep. Gotta make sure I'm in such a position where it won't like slam into anything trying to get me. Okay, so my ship's there. Ah, they sounded terrified. Oh, assault cannons. Thorats firing. Auto, or auto cannons. Guns. The rapid fire makes me think of auto cannons. The turrets don't appear to be doing all that much. You're kind of dragging it away from their max range. Not really. I'm trying to not get shot. <laughs> yeah, the drone is like at 700 meters from them. 
Judging by where the traces flare out. I don't think my ship's going to run out of ammo at a really inconvenient moment. <laughs> yeah, ah. I can see that happening. Oh, sound like a hit. All oh, right, my ship's only set to only target weapons, I think. Oh, it looks like it's lost the um, gyro. There you go, it's down. Hey. All right, ah. back onto the carrier. Oh. Ah, yes, when I'm missing thrusters, I slow down a lot. What? Um, what? Can someone quickly grab a battery, like a tiny battery, and Did you come just over run to out me? Of power? I just ran out of power. Capac, I'm docking my ship. Can you do that? I uh, can see if we got bits for it. Just get a tiny battery. Just a tiny that's, battery that's and fly battery. straight out the bottom of the ship. You'll see me. I'm floating away at 20 meters a second. You've got to do this quickly. I'm doing it as quick as I can. Uh, where are you? Which way did you go? Bottom that's of the ship. Easy. I'm floating away from the bottom of the ship. Very dark. I don't can't see, see you anywhere. No. Just head towards the sun. Oh, towards the sun. Oh, there, I think. Is that an asteroid? I think I see him. Uh, he's to the right of the sun, like right on the edge of the beam circle. Oh, I see something. Yep, that looks like him. Okay. If you Unfortunately, can get that... I haven't got the stuff, though. Where's Kapak? Uh, he's we're right 1. here already. Five do, you reckon, do you reckon you can go get some stuff too, TFE? Uh, maybe. Problem is I won't necessarily be able to find you again. Well, yes, you will, because I can send you a GPS. Uh, I need four power cells. Oh. Okay. I'll create a GPS to help you guys get to where I am when you guys are ready to come back with those power cells. I wasn't expecting to mount a rescue mission. <laughs> I know. I wasn't expecting you to either. I really need to put a connector on the carrier for this so it can recharge. Well, there's a connector from my other ship that has now exploded. Oh, yeah. Oh. That works. Let Our me know cells. when you guys need the GPS. Okay, I have, I have 21 power cells. Oh, the spinning. The spinning. So much spinning. Yeah. Oh, I see you. I think the battery that came back placed on there, if finished, should give me enough charge to get home. I'm so used to throwing away wasabis, I wasn't even thinking about it. Oh, thank goodness you haven't... Rifted into. Oh, that assert ship's actually pretty close. Oh. Oops. Phew. Go! Okay. Uh, where's the carrier? Thank you. Uh. Well, this doesn't feel right. What's that? Kevin, what are you doing? You're like T posing up. He's T posing in space. Uh, well, I'm dead, so that would explain <laughs> that. Hey. What? Uh, I've respawned on a very villainous looking ship. That's probably mine. Oh, and your body's just vanished. How did you die, Kabak? Uh, I smashed into your ship at high speed. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it is your ship. Why does your ship look like Darth Vader's lair on the inside? <laughs> I reckon that? it looks like a colonoscopy on the inside. No, I changed the lighting. It's not red anymore. Oh. I've never seen Kevin complain so much about a ship that's got solar panels. I thought I'd respawned on like a pirate ship or something. <laughs> I'm blending in with the pirates. Um, should we meet in the airlock where we always meet? Yeah, let's let's um meet to look at what Kevin's done with the um jump drives when I haven't been distracting him with stupid yeah. attacks that I shouldn't have done that was a terrible decision. Yeah, but what are you doing? Let them kick him. Oi! <laughs> is he kicking your robot? No, Kapak is. Yeah, that's what I said. Is he kicking your robot? He looked at me funny. Interesting, Kapak. I did something else as well. What's your something else you did? Look in the corridor. Yeah, I saw the glass windows why no spin because it would take too much space mm. valid that's valid we could we could i guess we could do something fun with the lighting to make it have some movement how many so this is eight 
jump drives? Yep. Could it move up a couple of blocks? Nope. Why not? Because. Why not? Because it can't. Why? It's against the law. The reason I'm asking is because otherwise these jump drives at the bottom are really exposed. You said you didn't want them next to the hydrogen tanks. Hmm. That's why I was asking about the heavy armor because I was thinking about heavy armor plating the bottom section underneath. Ah, right. I guess, I guess instead we could do internal heavy armor between the hydrogen tanks and the jump drives. Tempted to get a robot myself, but I don't want it to weld up stuff around here because I kind of don't want to build the thrusters on this until I know we've got the materials for it. Well, I royally stuffed up today. Agreed. I mean, the rest of us didn't exactly do brilliantly either. <laughs> <laughs> However, I did manage to get the corridor below us complete. So we've now got the auto crafting stuff working. We've got all those bits and pieces set up. Um, Capac, it looks like you've got the jump drives planned out at least. So we should be able to do something kind of cool with some lighting in there, even if we can't have it moving. It's probably best we don't have it something that heavy mobile, to be honest. Even though it would have been cool. You can always have a spinny reactor at some point, I guess. Um, in fact, we could probably put the reactors above the jump drives. With the space that's there. That worked nicely. Uh, so, next time, um, I'm not going to try and push you guys towards piracy. I'm going to let you guys push me towards piracy when you decide that we're out of materials and that's the best way to get them. So there's all that and plenty more to come. There you go. I pushed you towards piracy. <laughs> and we will see you then. Catch you next time, everybody. Bye. <laughs>